What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Profit back for my next video. And it's not going to be a good video. Well, not a good video for me. Because I didn't have a situation. I see my girl Candy. She didn't caught a flat tire. Well, she didn't blew out a tire. You see that? Man, I don't even know how this happened. I was just cruising down the freeway and started to feel a weird little shake. And the car was riding rough. I'm like, man, what is going on? I'm not sure what that is. And I pull over and look at my girl on the flat. But luckily, I don't see any damage to the, to the actual rim. No, like not even no scratches. It's just like the rubber kind of burnt off on there. So that's a good thing because this is a two-piece wheel. And sometimes you break that barrel, which is the actual chrome part right here that you see. That barrel costs like $700 to $800 to replace that. So when you hit a pothole or something, you, you usually tear up the whole barrel. But I don't think I hit a pothole. I think I just might have had a flat, slow leak or something and didn't realize it was low. And I kept driving on it. And here we go. So anyway, y'all can see my whole little process of me getting this wheel fixed, getting me a new tire. crazy it's a brand new tire man i don't think i got 500 miles on these tires i doubt it but uh i just did a full inspection and i don't see any kind of cracks any damage at all everything is fine i can't even tell what happened to this tire i just see like it just blew out right here in the back side and on the front side i don't know see that good so I got lucky I guess I mean these tires ain't cheap man but it could have been a lot worse I keep on hearing about how cheap Ruchis are and how they known for cracking easy but I don't think it matters man I'm riding on the tire this small and they just small tires period when you're riding in some of these raggedy cities with these potholes, man, if you hit one, it's gonna just cause damage. You know what I mean? So, I don't believe I actually hit a pothole. I just had some kind of a slow leak somewhere. And I just kept driving and didn't know it was leaking and here we are. So, let me go ahead and get to a tire shop and try to get this tire swapped out. I'm even debating on going with a thicker profile. I got a 255, 25 by 24 on here right now. I might do a 255 by 30, which will give me a little bit more meat that'll help, you know, against impacts and stuff like that. But I have to change the other side too. And that one, like I said, they brand new tires, man. So I'm gonna just go down here and get some prices and just go from there and make up my mind. So let's get to it. All right, so it's time to start this mission. I'm finding me a new tire. So I can get candy back out here on the road in time for these next couple of car shows. So I hope this goes easy and simple. I'm gonna head back to the city, to Hot Wheels City where I got these rims and everything from. So they should have this size in stock. I'm hoping they do. If not, I'm gonna be in trouble, I guess. Let's see. I already called one Hot Wheel City out here by my house, and of course they don't have this. They didn't have it in stock, so to the city I go. Fucking shit here, dog. What's going on, Nick? Nope. I need a tire. Two fifty-five, twenty-five. Everybody got them. Everybody got them. Everybody. Been out for two weeks. I need those. So how long I gotta wait? I don't know. We're waiting. We ordered like 12 of them. Look. These two right here, you asked me out over a month ago. What? 
still waiting on tire form for Camaro. Oh, shit. 255, 25, same one. Look at the motherfucking center. Oh, that don't spin on that one? It does when you pull. Oh, okay. That's that new and new. Damn. <laughs> Should've waited for those. It's like, no <laughs> Now that's what's right. up. Everything cool though, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's a car show this weekend. I'm trying to get you this car show, Nick. Oh, that's fucked up. See what's new. Let's see what's new up in here. Gucci guy. Oh, these boys would be cold on one of those Firebirds, man. Look at those. Trans Am. This that gold brush. I think this that gold plate right here. It's a little bit of a difference. Look good though. Stop number two. Hey, how you doing, man? I'm looking for a 24 inch tire. 255. Huh? For what? A 24 inch tire. Why I got a YouTube channel, so uh, I'm getting footage for the channel. 255, 25. 255, 25. 24? Yes, sir. One passenger side. Okay. Lionheart. Lionheart. I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna have a Lionheart. Let me see what you got if you got it. Let me see what I Get the Tudo Tahoe. Man, these used to be hot in Detroit. Everybody wanted to have a Tudo. Look at the Ruchis, 20, what are those? I can't even tell. 28s. I actually had these. If you go back on my page, I had these same rims. I was gonna put them on a Camaro. But I didn't really like how that look was, but them boys is kind of cold when you look at them. Full of dishes. Man, I think I'll still buy one of these. Just to have in the collection. It's cold, man. I'm ready to get my girl back out here on the road. 
Ah, damn, boy, look at that Ruchi right there. Damn. They hit a mean pothole. Jeez. Check out these boys right here. 28 inch replicas. That's it. 295, 25 by 28. My boy, it's cold, man. I do a set of these. You ain't always gotta have no root cheese or no 4Gs, man. You can get you a nice little clean factory look, but in a 28, 30 inch, you feel me? Cold. That's a lot of work. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> 